Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you how to reach advanced master settings in Windows 10. This is also referred to as God Mode. It's pretty easy to do. Let me show you what I mean. First of all, if you have Windows 10, you know that you can come down here and click the Windows icon, and it'll bring up the Windows Start menu, and one of the options you have is Settings. And if you click Settings, it'll bring up the Settings menu, and it's really easy to go in and change anything. Of course, not all the settings within Windows 10 are available through this menu. There is another group of settings that you probably can't get to unless you know some secrets. In Windows 10, there's something called God Mode, and if you start that up, it brings up a large menu of more settings. You have administrative tools, you can change your autoplay settings, you can set up your backup and restore settings, color management, credential management, date and time, default programming, lots of other things including display, adjust clear type, adjust screen resolution. It's everything from magnifying glass to voice repeat to on-screen keyboard, file history, home group, lots and lots of settings. In fact, there's over 200 settings here, and they're really easy to use. All you have to do is click them to start them. To get to this God mode, you have to add a little file to your computer, and I'll show you how to do that. What you have to do is right-click anywhere on your desktop, choose New, choose Folder, and in the folder name, paste in the string that I'm going to paste in right here. And once you paste that in, press Enter. And you'll notice that the folder name immediately goes to God Mode. And if you click on that folder, it takes you to the Advanced Settings screen. Now, you probably don't want to do this if other people are using your computer, because if they can just click on the folder on your screen and go in and change your computer settings, you may not like the results. But if you're the only person using your computer and you want to have access to these advanced settings, adding God Mode is probably a good idea. Now, if you do add it, you can hide it. You can put it in other places on your computer. But I keep mine right there on the screen. Anyway, to do that, all you have to do is add a new folder on your desktop and use the string that you see on the screen. Now because you probably don't want to type that entire string in, I'll put it in the description below this video. Anyway, I thought you might be interested in finding God Mode in Windows 10. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips of the week. You can find more like this at www.bmyers.com.